do. You get a sheet, and that sheet has 13 stamps. This is so cool. Oh, I think I found the first one. Let's get it. In the transport museum, guys, if you're a kid and you're under 17, you can go here for free. But if you're an adult, you only have to pay for one, um, one time in the transport museum. And then you can go every single day in one year. That is so cool. Isn't it, guys? So, guys, why don't we walk along the corridor? So we can travel back like even says it cool please take the lift to travel back into the 1800 yay We got to see the mode of transport in London at that time. We saw cars and horses. It looked like so much fun. We also saw the old trains, sat on them, and they were so, so comfortable. My sister and I got to drive some buses and they did our very own trains. It was so fun. Keep watching, make sure you like, share and comment your favourite bus in the description down below. Bye!
just come and talk about it. I need to first escalate us. So
thing a normal bus would have. It has an oyster card and I can even have a CCTV so I can check on my passengers. You can either use oyster, your oyster card or contact list. They even had real brakes. It was just so complicated. I don't know how a bus driver actually gets around with it. It's just so cool. I remember when I was being a bus driver for a day. So, so fun. So guys, I need for you to comment down below what these lines represent. I'll give you one clue. The yellow line represents a circle. So there's a greyish one, um, a turquoise one, and there's also a black one, or brownish black one. There's a yellow and green one right there. There's some brown one, and there's a white one. There's an orange one, and there's a blue one. And guys, if you know, alright, make sure you comment down below what they are. Or if you've been to London before, you you should know what they. Are. Guys, my sister just loves this game. Maybe it's because she loves puzzles. Well guys, I'm sorry if you didn't see her in the video too much. She was too busy collecting stamps and she was so tired. I'm so sorry. But maybe you'll see her more often. So guys, here we are playing the Three Market Challenge because we are making our own trains. Or if you can say, we are designing our own trains. I got pink, blue, and purple. And she got pink, blue, and yellow. The colors are so nice. Look at mine, guys. It's so pretty, isn't it? And look at my sister's. It's kind of pretty, too. It's really, really pretty. Time to cut. You have to use safety scissors, guys. Now, right now we're gluing all the pieces together so it can look like a real train. This is so fun. Eh, this is hard. I think I need more glue. Okay, I've done one side. Now let's see if I can do the other side. i done it! Now let's put our wheels on! So guys, I just finished putting my wheels on. Just got four wheels, she's looking very, very tired. And you have to use the clay to stick the wheels to the train. And guys, here is like an old like painting of what the world used to look like in 1984. I think this might have been the, you know, lift in the train centre. Thanks for watching! Watching! See you soon! Bye!